In this tutorial, we're going to talk about how to set up your tab groups up top here and to clean up all of your modules, which each one of these tabs represents. So if you click on the Settings tab, it's going to take you to this page. And under Customization, you're going to see Modules and Fields. And there are a lot of things you can do here. Here's all of your modules that can be organized. Here's your tab groups. We'll talk about those. And you can also set up web tabs as well. This adds a tab up here that links out to an external source, in this case, Mapsly. So let's start with modules. Uh, you've got a little Organize Module button here. And if you click on that, you'll see that every single module is checked, which means they're all pretty much available. Now, Command Center and Home, you can't change those. Those have to be there. But let's look at a few things you can do. If you have Zoho Finance, one of the things you're really going to want to do is you're going to want to get rid of quotes and sales orders and purchase orders and invoices, because those are all replaced by the Zoho Finance module. Most people don't really use feeds. They don't use uh, sales inbox. You may or may not use social or visits. Maybe you know, you're just trying to clean things up. If you're using Zoho Desk, you're probably not going to use solutions. And if you're not using solutions, then you're not going to use cases. You can kind of get rid of those as well. Uh, so once you kind of go through, probably you know if you're using Google Ads, great. If not, take it out. Only have the modules that you want to have in here. And once you hit Save, you'll see it cleaned up this significantly. By the way, they're not got, gone for good. They're just hidden. You can always go back to the Organize Module tab and put any of them that you want right back in, and then they'll be saved. So that's part one, kind of going ahead and cleaning up and getting rid of the modules you don't use, or at least hiding them. Uh, then when we go into Tab Groups, well, we've created two here. One's called Snowmobiles, and one's called Core Tabs. And what this allows you to do is really just define the things that you want people to see. So you, of all of the tabs here, you say these are the active ones. Now, this is going to limit it to just the ones that are active. So once this is active, you can then go through and just choose the one that you would want perhaps a snowmobile salesman to see. And those are the tabs that are going to be available there. And then you can set up core tabs. So what that looks like is if I go up top here and I go to the snowmobile group, it's going to condense this just to be the things that are appropriate for snowmobiles. And if I go to core tabs, these are maybe the tabs that I work with all the time. Or you can go to all tabs, and it's going to give you all of the tabs that are currently available. So that's pretty much it. Very, very simple, kind of easy to clean these up. Sometimes people really struggle with all of these choices up top here and with all of the different modules, especially when they're not using them. Just get them out of the way. It'll make your life a lot easier. We hope this helped. Thank you for listening.